look, it's Norman Bates. We all go a little mad sometimes. Oh, he's seen the tram. He's seen us. He's got a knife. Let's get out of here. It's Norman Bates with Movie Psycho. Oh, he's watching the tram. He's watching us. There he is, Norman Bates, psycho. Now the set you've all been waiting for, the crash site from Steven Spielberg's movie, War of the Worlds. This is a real airplane that was destroyed for the set. It's from the 2005 film, War of the Worlds, starring Tom Cruise. You go ahead and stand up here if you want, take pictures and video of the set. You can stand up. You want to walk over here? Go ahead and walk over here. Yes. You can stand up. If you want to stand up, take pictures. You're welcome to stand up. People look at this, they're flying out the same day. Sorry, I did. Here to tell you more about this set, production designer Rick Carter and director Steven Spielberg. The airplane that crashed the site set is a perfect example of a set that is all designed around a vision that Stephen had. We first began to sit down to talk about the war of the world. And I thought, what if the 747 goes down right in a big neighborhood? Because it's, it's just something you don't see. You're doing good. Oh, you're doing good. Keep your eyes on me. That's how I am. Listen, I want you to close your eyes, okay? Just get them closed. <laughs> Robbie, get in. Get in. Backlight can double as basically any city or place in the world, but 